Well, guys, I decided to actually start a, um, well, not really an LP of uh, Pokemon since everyone and their mother has done one. I just wanted to do something a little different. Um, I wanted to do a uh, challenge run, I guess. And, of course, that I know doesn't sound like actually all that original, definitely even regards Pokemon. So, you know, because there's other ones like Nuzlocke and Random Nuzlocke and various other ones. But then, as I was looking through, trying to figure out what kind of challenge to do for Pokemon, I came across this, um, well, the e-reader, which was this peripheral for the Game Boy Advance, that you swipe cards and you could get extra stuff in your games and stuff like that. Well, I came across ones for Pokemon. Uh, the ones for Ruby, Sapphire, and Emerald. And they had special trainers that you can go against. These are challenges for this. And so I looked on, I was looking on YouTube to see if there was any videos of it. I found only one. <laughs> well, as of this recording, I only found any one. And I said, okay, well, there's my challenge right there to go through all, I need to go through those challenges. But of course, I couldn't just do it like regularly because, well, that's not really that big of a challenge. I mean, it is a challenge, but it's not that big of one. So, to make it more interesting, I have thought of a, well, the, it's called the Pokemon e rear Battle Challenge. Um, pretty much, the, the, the challenge itself is pretty simple. Uh, you choose three Pokemon, and you have to beat all 48 trainers. Now, there's 48 trainers for the first volume of the actual trainers, well, trainer packs that came out, but those only, the only volume one came out to the U.S. and Europe and Australia, and the other two only, and the other two just came out in Japan, so I'm only doing that one because I can't read Japanese that well. And I'm not going to go through all that just to maybe show off something. And um, another part of the challenge, as well as is only using three Pokemon, is also the le the maximum level of the Pokemon that you have cannot exceed the average level of the Pokemon of that the trainer has. So, like the first set of challenges isn't so bad because everyone is all the same level, but as you go up and fight different ones, well, actually it's more the ones in the middle, the well, the majority in the middle since they're, you're most likely going to be like, some are going to be a couple levels higher than you, some are going to be a couple levels lower. So it shouldn't be too bad. I mean, I haven't actually 100% gone through this challenge already. I'm just making it up for you guys to, maybe you want to do it yourselves. Um, any item arrangements that the opponent has, you get to, because might as well, right? So if they all have focus bands or whatever, I held items, you get that, you're allowed to have that too. Hey, good for the geese, good for the gander. Now, I'm doing something a little special on mine. You can do this too, but this is kind of more of a um, added difficulty. Uh, the Pokemon that I'm using cannot have, as of this particular generation, which is for Ruby, Sapphire, and Emerald is Generation 3, have no evolutions. That means ones that do not evolve. Now, mind you, if they, that way, if they get evolutions later on, it doesn't, like, make it null and void and stuff. So, um, now, also, I'm also, you can't, I'm also, also part of the main challenge is, well, not the main challenge, but mine is, uh, under this caveat, on uh, caveat, ooh, is, that they can't be a legendary and it can't be a unique. And why a unique? I mean, ones like you can only have one, like you that you know, like in the original Red Blue um, Mewtwo, it's a unique. It's only one in that game. And you can only capture it. While the legendary birds, as well. Uh, that's only that's the really the only thing that I have for this challenge because I don't know how far I'm going to get in these. But I will be uploading videos and of all the ones that I at least get through. And we'll see how far I get through it. I don't know how far I'm going to get through. So now on to actually discussing the actual cards themselves. Um, each trainer is ranked from uh, 
co um, rate from copper, bronze, silver, and gold. Of course, from least difficult to more diff most difficult. Um, most of the ones you're going to fight that I've seen are going to be bronze level, bronze and silver. Um, um, these are, well, you'll see in the video, um, you have to link up your um, Game Boy Advance copy to your e-reader copy and transfer it and all this other stuff. Of course, um, the way to do that, you'll, uh, you'll, you can find that out on the internet. Um, of course, I'm using an emulator, so whatever. Uh, now, there's another thing I'm going to be using in this, so nobody thinks I'm like cheating or anything. I will be using a 99 uh, item code for rare candies just so I don't have to go and grind in between each one of the each one of the challenges. I can just get my characters to uh, get my Pokemon to a proper level and just do it like that. Um, and that's pretty much the really major uh, code use I'm going to use. Code I'm going to use. Uh, I'm not going. I don't use any codes to make them like have the best stats or anything like that, or try to hack in like other abilities they sh they shouldn't have. So, how far am I going to get into this challenge? I don't know, but we'll all find out together, I guess. And um, that's the challenge. So, in the next videos that are coming after this, well, in this part of this playlist, will be the challenges. Um, each one will have an introduction to the actual per uh, each. Introduction to the to the trainer and what you know what category they are and stuff like that and of course each battle I'll give my commentary because it's not going to take too long for battles and it's probably not even going to be as long as this intro video that it will tell about well as I said give you stats essentially so on to the uh, Pokemon and hey if guys if you well and guys I mean in a general sense obviously if you want to participate in this challenge hey you sending the videos of you doing those battles and what Pokemon you use and everything like that and I might just link it on there you know uh, yeah maybe give a thumbs up if I approve of how you did it you know I most likely will because hey if you're gonna do this might as well give you a thumbs up at least put you know God gave you a thumbs up for effort right so with that, let's begin this challenge. <laughs> 